Trinidadian-born, UK-trained Dr. Natalie Johnson started her career at the University of the West Indies, where she said she had a strong support system in her home country. I had such an intense community that it helped with whatever was missing that mom and dad couldn't give me that they did. You know, they were like aunties, so to speak. At the age of 23, and without the support system she had become accustomed, Dr. Johnson entered the UK surgical system as a junior officer or intern. Keep in mind, I am a black female, non-British um, surgeon training in a, a, a specialty that was made for the typical surgeon, which is a white male. And when you are trying to have a family, plus a career, plus being without a community or a support network, even if I were just a, a white British female, that in itself had its challenges. She trained in vascular, urology, breast and general surgery. Now stationed at the Royal Marsden Hospital, which is one of the top five cancer hospitals in the world, Dr. Johnson is an oncoplastic surgeon. During her studies, Dr. Johnson and lead breast clinical specialist Sarah Adoma developed a prosthesis for women of color who have had a mastectomy. Fondly referred to as a softy, it is a lightweight, breathable, cotton, triangular-shaped mound that goes above the skin and fits into the brassiere in place of the removed breast. The softy has been introduced to the women of the Royal Marsden Hospital and has changed the way the women of color once viewed the healthcare system. They now feel included, they now feel considered, they trust the system a little bit better because, as you might be aware, historically, people of colour, through experience, through historical events, feel that they're not given the same clinical respect or they're not heard or they're not listened to when they present to their doctors or they don't feel they have the right to speak out. What she thought was a modern take on an existing innovation became a first for many women around the world. Women are sized and measured and color matched for the softy, which is given to them as part of their healing and care pathway. This is not for patients to purchase by a Nubian skin. It is for the institutions to purchase them so that it is provided as part of their care pathway. Just like a dressing you put on after you've had an operation. You're not meant to go and buy dressings on your own. This is supposed to be provided to you as part of the pathway. Otherwise, it will not be equitable. The project was funded by the Royal Marsden Cancer Charity and manufactured by Nubian Skin. I am Kimberly D'Souza and this is See Yourself on TTT News.